a graphic video of a massacre spread online in April 2023 in African countries, including Cameroon and Burkina Faso. People claim that it showed black foreigners being killed in war-torn Sudan. By analyzing several clues in the video, we managed to prove that the footage was actually shot in Ethiopia in June 2022. More than 500 people had died in fighting between Army Chief Abdel Fattah al burhan and his rival Mohamed Hamdan Daglo, head of the paramilitary Rapid Support Forces in Sudan in mid-April 2023. That was when the video started circulating online. We chose to blur part of the video due to its graphic content. In a three minute clip, men in military fatigues beat with sticks and relentlessly kick other men lying on the ground. At one minute and 30 seconds, a man passes in front of the camera holding a water bottle with a blue label bearing the word one. A Google search with the words one water brand led us to a similar looking bottle with the word one on its label in the same white font under a yellow wave. This picture was posted on the Ethiopian brand One Waters website. According to this page, One Waters factory is located southwest of the Ethiopian capital city, Addis Ababa. Another clue appears at 1 minute and 48 seconds on the chest of the same man carrying the water bottle. A full striped flag is soon on his fatigues. Each stripe has a different color, black, green, white, red, with a black star position on the white stripe. But that doesn't match the Ethiopian national flag, which is composed of three stripes, green, yellow and red, with a blue disc and a yellow star. So what does it stand for? A Google query with the words red, white, green, black flag Ethiopia leads us to a Wikipedia list of various Ethiopian flags. One of them matches exactly the flag in the video. It represents the Gambala region close to the border with South Sudan. We cross-check this finding with other flag specialized websites. Many pictures online, like this one on the Alamistok website, shows it flying over Ethiopian cities in the region alongside the national flag. When investigating a video, you might want to pay attention to the sound. Here, an AFP journalist from Ethiopia identified the language spoken by the men in the video as Amharic, one of Ethiopia's official languages. <laughs> Using the keywords video Gambela soldiers killing, we found a tweet from March 2023 mentioning this massacre. In this message written in Amharic, the Ethiopian Human Rights Commission shared a link to a report from the same date. This document confirmed that the video showed one of the incidents investigated and documented in its report on the killing of at least 50 civilians in Gambela city by the regional security forces from June 14 to June 16, 2022. It concluded that Ethiopian regional security forces carried out the killings in a conflict with two rebel movements, the Oromo Liberation Army and the Gambela Liberation Front. All these elements led us to conclude that the viral video had been taken out of context. The footage dates back to a killing in Ethiopia in June 2022 and has no link to the 2023 war in Sudan.